Hello, this is the No Face Movement with another breaking news. It's like it's not stopping. Um, it's January 14, 2013, and I got more breaking news on the Oran Nubili fires bullets. Alright, but before we get in this, this is the second strange thing coming out of Oran's belt. And if you look at NASA's logo, they're obsessed with Aura. Alright, Aries. You got NASA with this mysterious seven entity. And then you got six over here for Aura, circling the globe. Aries, the one eye, the pyramid. Now, if you look at other models, other patches and stuff, Apollo, you got three stars, Oran, the connection between Earth, it looks like, and some other planet with three stars, a six. Will that be a portal? Alright, so far tonight we reported on the all seeing eye. Formula Hawk B, the rogue planet, the zombie. And now we're reporting on Oran Nubula. Alright, it's shooting bullets. This is what they're calling it. Alright, this is what NASA is really calling this. Um, if you check this out, see all these blue things? These are what they're talking about getting shot out. And the scientists are amazed by it. And see all this orange stuff behind it? That's fire. So this is moving pretty fast. Could this be heading towards us? Could this be UFOs or other kind of life forms heading towards us? Could this be a barrage of comets and asteroids or missiles heading towards us? Or could this be the central galactic plane gravitational pull pulling at Orion? Alright. And just look at that image for a second. It's strange. Very. The Orion Nebula fires bullets the size of our solar system. The Orion Nebula, as the closest site of massive ongoing star formation to Earth, has long been one of the most intensely studied objects in the night sky. But it still holds mysteries, including these bullets emanating from its center. The so-called bullets are the blue regions in the above photograph, which was taken by the Gemini South Telescope in Chile. These dense, mysterious objects are ripping through the hydrogen clouds at supersonic speeds, and no one is exactly sure why. Most likely, these bullets were created less than a thousand years ago from a mysterious source inside the cloud known as IRC2. This particular image is a close-up image taken in the infrared spectrum, although we're still not getting too close to the bullets, considering just how huge they really are. NASA explains, Blasted out by energetic massive star formation, the bullets, relatively dense, hot gas clouds about 10 times the size of Pluto's orbit, are blue in the false color image. Glowing with the light of ionized iron atoms, they travel at speeds of hundreds of kilometers per second. Their passage traced by yellowish trails of the nebula's shock-heated hydrogen gas. The cone-shaped wakes are up to a fifth of a light year long. The detailed image was created using the 8.1 meter Gemini South Telescope in Chile with the newly commissioned adaptive optic system referred to as GEMS, GEMS. Achieving a larger field of view than previous generation adaptive optics, GEMS use five laser generated guide stars to help compensate for the blurring effects of planet Earth's atmosphere. And that's just crazy, folks. Because they don't even know what this is. They even said it. And they're not trying to get close because they would be humongous. Alright. But what is it? Alright, please leave a comment. Um, we're going to do some more research in this. Yes. I think it's just peculiar that all of a sudden that NASA is coming out with this. I think it's peculiar NASA all of a sudden is coming out with the one eye solar system that they knew for years if this was really happening. Um, if this was happening for a thousand years, this would have been 
by NASA years ago. Alright folks, please rate, subscribe, and comment. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Blogspot, uh, Critterbox, and uh, Godlike Production. This is the movement, moving the movement to next time, facing off.